Welcome to our live training session number 28. We're going to be tuning a supercharged Honda AP1 S2000 using Honda Decay Pro. Let's jump into some details about this vehicle. We're going to find it has a bone stock F20C engine. It also has a CT engineering supercharger kit, a Burke header, a Burke test pipe, and a aftermarket exhaust. Now, in addition to this, on the fuel system side of things, it has ID 1300cc injectors, an upgraded fuel pump, we also find that it has a flex fuel sensor that's been fitted to the fuel system. So we're gonna be doing both a pump gas and a flex fuel tune in this video. We also have a wide band that's been wired in and an oil pressure gauge. And we're taking a look at setting and configuring all of these details in our K-Pro. So let's jump into our live training session so we can create our base calibration and get started. Welcome to our live training session here with our supercharged Honda S2000. Now we just went over all the details of the vehicle, so let's jump into our K-Manager software we can create the base map and get started with this tuning process. So moving into our software here, going into the upper left-hand corner, we're gonna find we have new calibration. When I click that, it's gonna allow me to open up a base calibration file to start our tuning session with here. We're gonna modify everything in this calibration, so it's not gonna be super important which one we choose, but we wanna make sure that we have the right calibration type so we're able to use more of the advanced closed loop features I'm gonna be showing in this video. So moving down in through our list here, we can see we have an RSX Type S PRB. That's going to be the ECU type that we're using in this application. It is a S2000 specific converted PRB ECU from Honda, but we're going to be using this calibration type. We can see here if we click on our drop down menu, we're going to find that we have a couple different options here. We can see we have a PRA style calibration that's for an S2000. That's what Honda gives you here that's S2000 specific. Now, normally I would say that we would choose this. However, in this situation, because we want to use some of the advanced closed loop features, the PRA style calibration does not accept a wideband type that allows you to go in and use it for closed loop purposes. So it's not going to be ideal. So I'm going to skip that and use a PRB style file. So we'll move back into our directory here in our PRB. Now the PRB file is associated with an 02 to 04 RSX application. Now obviously we have an S2000 here, so looking through our list of files we have available, if we're kind of panning through, we're going to be finding it's going to designate what this uh, particular vehicle the file is from. We can see RSX, RSX, and if we go down the list here, they're going to be pretty much all the RSX with some variation, whether it's going to be a turbo kit, supercharger kit, larger injectors, uh, stock equivalent. We're going to be finding all kinds of different file types. Now, we could choose any of these files. It really wouldn't matter. We're going to be going through the process of modifying this entire calibration from start to finish, so it's not going to matter essentially what map we choose. However, it will make your life a little bit easier if you choose the correct one. So I'm gonna be going down here all the way at the bottom, and we're gonna find here, we have a couple different options. We find S2000, 06 to 09 Toyota header, 650cc injector, and then stock. I'm gonna be specifically selecting the stock.cal file. Now, this 06 to 09, uh, 09 S2000 application it was an older K-Pro that they discontinued. It was a dual K-Pro where the K-Pro went in line. Thanks for checking out our teaser clip. If you want to see the rest of this video and more than 500 hours of current EFI training we have to offer, make sure you click right here. If you want to go and check out more teaser clips from this training course, click here and you don't want to miss any of the videos we're going to be releasing on this channel. So make sure you subscribe and click here. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys later.